friendship is one of the nicest things to write about, and there are many, many things written about friendship. Children, my name is Elsa Holmlund Minerick, and I write books about little animals who can talk. I have always had little animals about me, and I sort of imagine that they can talk. Many little children ask me why I write about animals. I write about animals because I think they're funny and lovely. Where are you, chickadees? Breakfast time. My friends, the birds, are very, very hungry. Every morning, even before I can get into my clothes, I put on a heavy, warm coat and I put bird seed in a container and go out and feed all these many, many hungry birds. That is one of the nicest things that I know of. Nicest way to start a day is to feed your friends. <laughs> when I was your age, I knew that I wanted to be a writer. I knew it because I loved books so much. And before I even learned how to write by myself, I made up stories and asked my mother to write them down and then read them back to me and then allow me to copy them. And that was how I learned how to write and how to read. I've written many books about a little bear cub called Little Bear who lives in the woods with his mother and his father and has many friends. And the pictures have been drawn by that wonderful artist, Maurice Sendak. Little Bear was an only cub, in the way that many children are only children. And he didn't have any friends other than the grown-up friends, hen and cat and duck and owl, and though he loved these friends very much, they weren't really his age. He had someone to play with who was his age for the first time when he met little Emily, who was lost in the woods. Little Bear took Emily back to her parents' tent by the river, and on the way, they discovered that they could be very good friends. And so he had one of the loveliest summers in his whole life, playing with Emily while she was vacationing with her parents in the woods. I think that you little children are all my friends, and since you are my friends, I want to give you a good piece of advice. Now that you're learning to read and write, you should read as much and write as much as you can, because later on, if you perhaps want to write stories, this is the time to start. Do the very best you can with it. Friendship is one of the very nicest of subjects. All right, dear, we're going home now. <laughs>